Gallstones Diagnosis to Treatment. The topic will be covered in three lectures and this is the first of three lectures. So what are gallstones? Gallstones are solid stones formed in gallbladder from cholesterol, bile salts and calcium. They can vary in size from a few millimeters to a few centimeters. Gallbladder is a small pear-shaped organ lies on the inferior side of the liver that stores bile. Bile is a juice uh, which is produced in liver here and is required to digest fat. Liver lies under right hemidiaphragm in right upper quadrant of the abdomen. So liver produces bile and the bile is collected by these ducts, right hepatic duct, left hepatic duct here, common hepatic duct, cystic duct here, gallbladder and this is common bile duct which is connected to duodenum. Duodenum is a part of a small intestine. So the bile is finally transferred to the duodenum uh, and helps uh, digesting the fat. So what are the uh, steps involved in diagnosis? The steps are history taking, physical examination, imaging techniques, laboratory test and finally we'll discuss treatment options. History. In case of gallstones, patients uh, presents with uh, pain in right upper abdomen that increases rapidly and lasts from 30 minutes to several hours up to 5 hours, more so after meal. Pain in the back between the shoulder blades, pain under right shoulder, nausea and vomiting and patients can also have low grade fever. We also need to understand risk factors. So these are the risk factors and we'll discuss each risk factor. So sex. Women are twice as likely as men to develop gallstones. Excess estrogen from pregnancies, hormone replacement therapies and birth control pills all increase cholesterol level in bile which can lead to gallstones. Family history. Gallstones often run in families which means there are possible genetic links. Weight, obesity is a major risk factor for gallstones especially in women. Diet, diets high in fat and cholesterol and low in fiber increase the risk of gallstones due to increased cholesterol in bile. Rapid weight loss as the body metabolizes fat during prolonged fasting, the liver secretes extra cholesterol into bile which can cause gallstones. Age, people older than 60 years of age are more likely to develop gallstones although there are very frequent exceptions to this rule people as young as 22 23 can also develop gallstones ethnic groups uh, some ethnic groups are more prone to develop gallstones cholesterol lowering drugs drugs that lower cholesterol levels in blood actually increase the amount of cholesterol in bile in turn increase the risk of developing gallstones. Diabetes. People with diabetes generally have high levels of fatty acids. These fatty acids may increase the risk of gallstones. Rest of the topics will be covered in next, next, in next lecture. These are the references. Some of the description has been copied from these websites and the lecture is prepared for www.academyofprofessionals.com. Thank you very much.